Hey there, everyone! This is Aokao playing Mario Purchases a Planet for the low, low price of a human life. I guess. I mean, if we look at things concretely using the data we are given. Anyways, yeah, we're getting close to the end of World 1, but you know, no hurry. There's a banker now on the spaceship. Of all staff members we would have on the ship. Wouldn't think the banker is something I wouldn't necessarily feel like I need. This one is completed! See? There's... There's, there's, there's the metal, and there's there's a crown. I will never return to that place, but I will return to that flippy place with the dogs. I did all of this yesterday. So hey, check it out. We're gonna uncork this square of butter. But there's no levels. This is strictly on pris- Whoa! Okay, so you can go to these- You know what? That's pretty neat. Okay. Sure. Uh, but there's no level. It's just- Well, here's a- here's a Bowser. Bowser Jr.'s Fiery Flatilla. Star and Metal are both here. Bowser Jr.'s in this game. He wasn't in- No, he wasn't the first game. I remember now. Had kind of like boat level. He was like the boat level guy. Gobble gut. Oh no! Has an aching belly. Has a tummy ache. Poor gobble gut. Well, this looks fancy. Look at that super door there. It kind of looks like a game show, but behind the prize is like Fire Planet. <laughs> Sounds great. Yeah. See here we got like ship pieces doing things. That's pretty fun. Here we go. Going backward immediately. Where there's money, and I'm not picking up. Get out of here. Oh, look at that statue, though. There is some powerful craftsmanship among the Koopa Kingdom. So, the guys with the hat, I kind of remember those a little bit. Alright, well, he's on fun, just kind of running out of place. Here's a fire bar. In 3D. That's what it looks like. Yeah, that's pretty good. Get out of here. Alright, fall down that pit. That clomp is super massive. It is, like, very scary. I don't know if it's because he's also very close to the camera. Uh, is there anything on top? Wizard face! Uh, I don't know. Okay, well, there's a lever I'm gonna want to press, probably. Look, man. Uh, get on top! Get on top! Get on top of that swamp. Okay, that's how you do it. Hey, look at that. <laughs> look, man. I've played Mario games before, and they've hidden, like, red coins and stuff over Thwombs before, I figured. Yeah, Comet Metal's kind of roughly the same equivalent as a red coin, sort of ish. Look, man, I am aware of Nintendo's video game vocabulary. Oh, that skeleton lost his head. He was so shot. Whoa! Everyone experienced that pause, uh, and everything is, like, super pixely here. It's pretty good. Alright. So, clearly... Whoa, something is afoot. There are shenanigans afoot in this area. That's fine. Welcome to the planet where you can do that. And then you go around. How about that? Alright. Yeah, like, the anti-alias thing just kind of, like, doesn't work here. That is wild. Here's a tip. We need to lay on tight spaces. Jump and spin! Please show me, strange TV! Alright. Check it out, it's me. It's Retro Mario. Whoa, let's check it out. See how I can spin around, land on the skeleton, and spread its bones around. The bone spreader. And then, you know, then you spread the wizard's bones, too. For some extra spice. Uh, great way to pull off a precise landing. Yeah, no, that, that, that makes sense, though. Alright, let's check it out. Uh, I did it. I got those. I didn't get all of them. But see, you don't need, though, to spin to land on the skeleton. It's pretty- Whoa, you just created an unripe Goomba. Pretty impressive. You can just create life like that. And you're letting your cell get bossed around by a- By- Not even the big dragon. But a big dragon's a son. Like, that's kind of disappointing. Alright, I'm gonna go and get the health mushroom. Sounds like a great idea to me. There we go. Just going all around the place, being very careful. And blast off to the planet where all my, uh... All the borders of our polygons have been, uh, <laughs> sent back to a nice round scene. I don't have a voice for baby Mo uh, Bowser. He's got a little, like, Dr. Wily's 
saucer. Gobblegut. What a name. Uh, well, why would you... Well, he is a small child. I can't fault him for that tactical faux pas. Like, let's be real. Oh, it's a dragon. Okay. Oh, yeah. It has, like, these strange circles on its body, and it's making me uncomfortable. I'm just gonna go ahead and say it. Oh, he's a train, though! He looks bored. Bellyache Orb! Uh, okay. Uh, I cannot see anything. Like, where am I? Where am I in space? It's a good question. Okay, so he goes down, and that's when I can hit him. Oh, that's super gross. I hate this. Oh, no. Oh, all these, these, uh, these star beds are just hopping there. Yeah, I gotta get those before it's too late. All right, so his billy eggs are back in orb form. Like, he has, like, these sacks of belly ache nuts. That's very strange. All right, yeah. So, like, you know, mm-hmm. He's trying to go for a bite. Here you go. And then I'm just gonna get here like a jerk. Oh, shoot. I missed. Uh, and I did get hurt. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, and I missed there, too. All right, okay. My task there was to... Yeah, you gotta... Ooh, I gotta eat that coin before... I lose like a whole circle. Oof. Um, maybe I should hang out here, waiting for uh, pain orb sack to arrive. Oh, this is a messy fight, man. Okay, well I missed that. Like he's all just knotted up in a knot. It's just very, very uncomfortable for everyone present. Okay, well, I got the money at the same time he hit me, so we're just kind of exactly where we were. So is that the only one I have left? The one that's like at the very end of his body? This is what it looks like to me. Alright, so we gotta be careful. Long body, you know, so it's gonna take a little bit. There you go! Hey, I relieve you of all your pain. You don't have those Billy A glands holding you back. Except, that's gonna make him explode. <laughs> oh no! It was load-bearing pain! The pain is what was keeping him alive! That's just sad! Oh, that is tragic! I don't like to think about that! Oh no, poor guy! Oh hey, it's a Grand Star! That's right, that's a big deal! all spin around and just kind of jiggle around We're like woo wow wow we just make those sounds constantly to express the fact that you are alive hey why not hey Patra I got this massive star that's gonna let you go to a new world like yeah now here we could get like well or did we open a portal okay so the small stars serve as fuel. The big star, though, we can't use that as more fuel. But it will open up a portal, naturally. Got some money. Got a little bit of everything. Wow! Use the power of that grand star trial to another world. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. Just in time to an unknown world we go. I have, so our, our, okay, so the game is deciding this for me, which, fair enough, we're gonna portal this, oh, oh wait, are we gonna change the background, are we not gonna be, like, over, like, Earth, and the Earth equivalent, is World 2 gonna be, like, around some, like, it doesn't matter, because the levels themselves are, like, just, like, whatever, but, yeah, like, see, now we're in an orange space. With the sun very close, and you can see the lines of their uh, revolution around their star. Plenty of power stars here. Yeah, so here's a world we don't know. We're just gonna roam around, and uh, I need to check something. Well, first of all, starless. Yeah, okay, so you do that. So, so, so everything is complete. Only one is complete. Fantastic. If I... Return now. Is there gonna be like a comet somewhere doing something? Those are just fireballs that are floating around. I guess just comets are just not cometing yet. Like I want a comet. I want a comet to happen. 
I guess I'm just gonna have to move on and do something in World 2. Big ol' wooden puzzle plank! Ooh, starting with a one fur. Okay. Fair enough. Maybe there's just gonna be more one-shots. Which, you know, if you have to go back for comments and whatever, like, I guess that makes sense. World 2! Puzzle Plane Galaxy, the puzzling picture book! Oh boy! I only have four lives somehow. <laughs> I did not get a lot of lives. There were not a lot of bonuses. Yeah, this is just welcome to Wood Town. Just every oh, hey, I remember the Scuttlebugs. There's a wrench floating by that is super massive. Okay. Welcome to the galaxy. Well, that's like, that's one of those things. Just Yeesh! Okay, I heard this before. I heard this song before. Well, look at that. Here we go. I got rewarded. Now I'm gonna walk Wiggler around. Wait, Wiggler, how you doing? Well, there. No, that. Oh, okay. So every plunger has a different kind of prize. This one plays a lovely song you might remember if you've played a video game before. I never, so... Uh-oh. I just kind of went into the, the song a little early. Alright, well... Okay, so I think it's just the order you press them. It doesn't matter if you hit a specific one. Look at that, yeah, like it's all a different little, little different prize depending on which one. That's pretty good. He's so mad and I'm glad I made him mad. Oh, he's flipped around again. What an idiot. Oh, now he died. So, okay, so hop. Hop upon being on your back. The Mario Verb of Kings. So there might be some other things on that box. I won't be able to know. Welcome to something, though. Going around. Look at that. There's, okay. Oh, you want money. How much money, friend? So hungry, you'll give me 70. I have six. How am I gonna get 70? Am I able to return here? I have no idea. I can smash these. I cannot. Okay, okay, no, no. Oh, wait, 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 though. There's a big coin up there. There's like, there's a big coin effect. So clearly, something's gonna something. Alright, and also, you know, there's money bushes here. For fun. Alright, I see there's that guy. Uh huh. Hey, buddy. Okay, so we got a small amount of money here. Not a very impressive amount. We got a pipe, though. Pipe just showed up. It's all like, hey, welcome to the pipe zone. Pipe! Alright, here's where all the money can be made. Alright, I will absolutely... There is more than 70 here, I'm pretty sure. The question is, can I hit enough of them? Also, there might not be more than 70. I, I, I thought I was sure. There was not, actually. And that is it. We heard the clapping. I'm still a little bit short. How many do I have? Do I just, like, don't do anything? Put show up. 67. I'm three short. You got any money on you here? What if I, like, pound down the state? I don't want that. I want money. Do you not understand my needs and requirements? Alright, well, about. Hey! Perfect! Uh, here we go. Just pound down the stake and then you can go and find a guy. Then you talk to him and he starts to dance. You shall have uh, all the money in my pocket other than two. Got a huge coin craving. Well, hey, buddy, it's all good. We're upside down right now. That's pretty freaky, isn't it? That's the stuff. Uh, it's gonna burst. It's gonna transform. Basically the same thing. That was aggressive. A new planet was born. It's a massive tree. With a save like right there. Pretty scary. That looks like a boss, doesn't it? Well, we now got Cloud Zone. Yeah, like we did the intro of what is Cloud yesterday. So now we can use them a bit more seriously. Whoa, sh whoa, s the save here. Yeah, okay. Yeah, it's you, it's your old boss, right? Except there were cattails to ride back then. Well, now we got this guy instead. We gotta time it. There you go. That counted. That did not look like I hit you. The game, I feel like, kind of gave me that one, and that's very nice of it. 
Okay, now he's pooping out uh, bombs, as a gross bug would do, probably. Oh, you did not like me just landing on you. Would you rather I just go with a violence immediately? Like, I can do that, and I will do that if that's preferable for you. Uh, like, I'm trying, like, I'm not, I cannot say I'm trying to make this painless for you, being realistic. But, like, I'm trying to make it as convenient as possible, if that makes any sense. Wah! Oh, I missed. But, you know, you get what I'm doing. This is weird, because I feel like, yeah, like, the game will let me just do that, right? Ooh! Oh, see? I landed on him, he hated it. That wasn't enough of a stun yet, though. No, like, the realistic, not idiot way to do that would be to... Oh, whoa, oh, whoa, whoa, you hate it! Would be to use the cloud to make myself platforms to be able to ambush him. That's not Nita, though! You know, just, uh... Just, just, just hop, just keep, just, just hop, just keep hopping. Just keep jumping real high up. And everything somehow's gonna work out. Uh, Oh yeah, here it's like all completely different looking. Back, boom's back. Uh, literally, it is his back, which is of interest. Did not find the, um, the 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 comet, and that's fine. We've unlocked. Oh, look at that! It's just two pathways. No, it's just that if you get the secret exit, you also get the normal exit at the same time. All right. Hey. Okay. All right. What's going on here? Buddy. Should have delivered. Oh, the mail guy! The mail is back, and he's right next to the banker. Humor him? No, like he has mail. You can see in his talk bubble, his speech bubble, he has like mail for me. Oh, sorry, sorry. How'd you get here, anyways? <laughs> I don't think you're gonna answer that. First letter. Oh my gosh! Unbelievable! I talked over Peach, sorry. Yeah, and I remember this. Like, you would deliver over some uh, one-ups, which I thought was very useful at the end game when I was playing the first game. So here's to hoping he's gonna come back and keep getting me things like that. So I didn't find the uh, metal for the wooden cube zone, but also, like, I just kind of abandoned everything to pursue a uh, lifetime of giving money to Aluma. So next time, normal exit there, and then we got split paths and everything. It's just a grand old piece of cake floating in the air. Well, where there's no air, absolutely massive, has its own gravity. 